It's simple. The strongest wins. You can't read me. Yes, actually. See this supply sphere? It's property of the Order. This is not the correct place for it at all. That's strange. Do you think someone stole this from the Order's repository and left it here? Yes, exactly. And it's not the first time it's happened. Stolen supply spheres are turning up all over. Of course, I have a good idea who the culprits are. The children of Etro, maybe? Exactly. It really is most exasperating. Not to mention worrying. Sabotaged. It could be a bomb. Mark my words, the heretics are dangerous. Who knows how far they'll go? You do know that the easiest way to find out what's inside would be to take a look? The, uh, well, as a matter of fact, I'm waiting for someone to come and deal with it as we speak. Though seeing as you're already here, the Order would be most grateful if you helped out. What do you want me to do exactly? Check all the spheres and see what's inside? Yes, each and every one. They're locked, of course. But this passcode should open them. Use this. After you've examined them all, come and talk to me. What should I do with the contents? If you've determined that there's no danger, you can keep whatever you find inside. Will that do as compensation? Oh, just don't forget to report back to me once you're done.
Welcome. <laughs> Let me know if I can be of any help. Oh, I see you didn't just wander in here by accident, did you? Not everyone knows what this is used for. You must know your stuff. Thank you very much. Well, I've checked them all. The supply spheres were clean, every one of them. Not even a hint of anything dangerous. Yes, uh, actually, I just found out the same thing on my end. Apparently, the whole thing was all just a big joke. Not a very funny one. Really? Damn it, this isn't the time for pranks. You're telling me. It was a young girl named Lumina. She's usually lurking around the cathedral. She said the spheres were supposed to be a gift for whoever found them. I should have guessed. She also left behind a message. A present from me to you. Good luck saving all our souls. Might she thought the savior would find them. Why, that would make you the savior. <laughs> if you see her around, tell her thanks for the extra supplies. And that I don't believe in luck. <laughs> I'll be sure to tell her that. She likes to have a little fun sometimes, but she means no harm. She knows her boundaries. She knows when enough is enough. Really? That's hard to believe. That little devil causes trouble everywhere she goes, and everywhere she doesn't. Now, now, we all need to give her a break. After all, these are trying times, and we all need to let off a little steam sometimes. She helps us laugh a little, and lightens the mood for all of us. Slow down. What are you doing racing around the city like that? I'll tell you, but only if you beat me, okay? The rule is simple. Keep up! Don't think you can beat me because I'm a kid. line is eventually. Ready, set, go! The goal is the Nord Station! It's now right. But I guess a loss is a loss. You said you were going to tell me what's going on if I won. You're going to keep your word, aren't you? It's nothing exciting or anything like that. It's just that the whole city seems so gloomy, don't you think? Everyone's so lifeless and boring. I thought this was a good way to add a little excitement. Show people how to have fun. I won't say it was a bad idea, but weren't there other ways? Maybe, but running's about the only thing I'm really great at. Yeah, I have to admit, you're pretty fast, but not as fast as me. Well, I'm happy if I helped you get your mind off things even for a little bit. Um... Lightning. Ha! That's a perfect name for someone fast like you. I'll beat you next time, Lightning. I was told about a special medicine that only you can make. Ah, uh, yes. Say no more. You want a flask of our super special, is that it? No problem. Uh, except we're all out. I'm really sorry. You're the second person we had to break the bad news to today. I can make more, but I can't get my hands on the ingredients. I wish I could have helped that poor girl. She needed it for a family member that took a turn for the worse. I'm here for her, actually. If I bring you the ingredients, can you make more? Of course, and I'll do it for free. Anything to help a fellow resident. Here's a list of all the ingredients. Mm. 
Is this everything you need for the medicine? You managed to get everything on the list? That's incredible! Now give me a few minutes while I work my magic. Here you go! The greatest man-made remedy of all time! I hope this works! What am I saying? I know it'll work! Hurry on back to the poor girl so she can help her father! I have something for you. Here. Is this really what I think it is? Are you absolutely sure that I can have this? I said you could, didn't I? Now go and take it to your father. Oh, I, I will. Thank you. You know, you may have just saved his life. You're one of the good ones. I didn't think there were many of you left. I don't know what to say. I just about lost faith in everyone. Did you tell people about your situation? If they knew... I tried, but no one even bothered to hear me out. And it wasn't even about the money. They just didn't want to get involved. I can't blame them for avoiding a poor girl from the Warren. I'd about given up when you came by. You were the only one who bothered to ask if anything was wrong, you know that? I guess there's still a bit of light in this city after all. Of course there is. It took a while, but you ended up getting what you needed to help your father, didn't you? Even though the world is consumed with darkness, people are still willing to help others. Have some faith. You're right. So what are you? Some kind of angel sent from the heavens or something? I know the world is ending soon and there's little time to do much else. But I pray the rest of your days are bright and full of bliss for you and your loved ones. And that's the truth. Why are they killing innocents? They could be trying to force you into making a mistake. These girls are just a bait, intended to lure you into a trap. Maybe it is a trap, but I still have to do something. Another one will be killed tonight. I'm starting to think we should just take these Etro fanatics head on. I hate to say it, but I agree. And the best way to do that is to infiltrate their rights. You've got to find the code by tonight. Then you'll be able to crash their party. The victim was a devout believer in God, and a dedicated member of the Order. I knew her when she was alive. She was a fixture in our neighborhood, always out on the streets, spreading the word of God. The victim was famous throughout the city. So devout was she, some believed she was the savior. She was killed because of her beliefs, I'm sure. There's no limit to the heretic's perfidy. I'm collecting donations on behalf of the Order. We ask that every true believer gives 100 gil to God. Bless you. May the Savior free your soul. I'm collecting donations on behalf of the Order. We ask that every true believer gives 300 gil to God. Bless you. May the Savior free your soul. I'm collecting donations on behalf of the Order. We ask that every true believer gives 1,000 gil to God. Bless you. May the Savior free your soul. True believers who give up their wealth to God shall be honored by the order. You bet your life, I bet mine. job.
Are you seeing this, Hope? It must be the Heretic Sanctuary. Hopefully we'll be able to find out more about this mysterious Shadow Hunter. I have a lot of questions I want to ask him. Like, why is he targeting you? You know the graveyard, right? The one out by the North Station? Well, I heard weird chanting coming from inside. It sounded like black magic to me. It really gave me the creeps. <laughs> what do you want? I'm here to help. Why do you think? Oh, and to have some fun of my own. If you're going after the goddess's children, there's something you should know. You know what this is, don't you? It's an oracle drive. It records the future. The children worship it. Yep. Whatever they see in it, they know it's a future that's bound to happen. Ha! Question. If someone believes everything this shows... This is who's going to kill me. The Hunter. What would they end up thinking? I mean, if they saw that oracle I just showed you. Well, Savior, can you guess? <sighs> sure. It would look like the Savior appears on the final day and she tries to destroy the world. But then a hero appears and puts an end to her sinister plan. Is that about right? <laughs> the evil savior will die at the hands of the Shadow Hunter. The Oracle says Noel's going to kill me. You got it! But you know what? They're very impatient, these Etro lovers. So they've started the hunt without him. Anyone who looks like the savior is fair game. So why hasn't he shown himself? What's he after? If Noel's supposed to be here, why is he hiding still? Tell you what. Ask him yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Noel Kreis. Or should I say, Shadow Hunter. That's what they call me. Enter stage right, ready to play your role in the show. We don't make the prophecies. They are what they are. And the future happens whether we want it to or not. You're going to try to destroy the world, and I'm going to stop you. Huh. I'm not planning to destroy anything, but I can't deny that I'm here on God's orders. Bonavelza. He named me the savior, and ordered me to rescue his people. Yeah, right. Just like the Oracle says. But it's too soon for our showdown, Lightning. When the time is right, we'll put an end to this. All of it. After all we've been through, you're telling me you still think these prophecies mean a damn thing? If you want the truth, I didn't until now. Who would believe you'd actually show up again out of nowhere after 500 years? Here you are, just in time for the final act, right on cue. You have to die, Lightning. 